So guys, let's talk about this confraternity war that is currently going on in Abia State University in the city of Omaha, right there in Abia State. I am sure most of you have seen when a hit squad was captured in a video, bringing down a young man around the school premises right there in the city of Omaha. This particular clash is said to be between Black Ass and Supreme Vikings confraternity and there has been different stories in the streets about what happened but in this video i am going to tell you guys what really transpired and i have a lot of information about this particular young man that was brought down because his matter has landed in my table some time ago so without wasting any of your time let's dive into the video so there was a video that went viral today when this young man that you are currently seeing on your screen was brought down now this young man is said to be a member of Black Ass and he was brought down by some young men who are believed to be members of Vikings. Now before I explain to you what happened before this young man was brought down, there are some informations about this young man that you guys need to know because it is said that this young man is a new member of Black Ass but he is not new to confraternity. Now they said this young man became a member of Black Ass about three months ago but he becoming a member of Black Ass has brought a lot of problems because this young man used to be a member of KK. Not just a member of KK, he used to be the number one man of KK right there in Abia State University. Now this young man woke up one day and said he is tired of being a member of KK and he decided to cross carpet to Black Ass. So when this young man crossed carpet to Black Ass about three months ago, the members of KK saw this as an embarrassment, they saw it as disrespect. So his picture was posted all over the KK platform and they declared him wanted. And this is about three months ago and this is when his matter first got to my table. And I'm going to pause this right here so that you know what I'm talking about. This is a declaration from KK members when they declared him wanted after he crossed carpet from KK to Black Ass and he has been on the radar of KK ever since. But now the reason he was brought down is said to be a different reason. Now they said that members of Black Ass and members of Vikings have been having some problems right Right there in Abia State University. Now the Vikings members have been very angry with Black Ass members because of what happened long time ago. They said a member of Vikings was killed by some Black Ass members. So that particular matter is still on ground and the members of Vikings have been angry because of that particular thing. And recently it is said that the Black Ass members collected a phone that belongs to a member of Vikings. So after this happened, the Vikings members called the Black Ass members and they said that the Black Ass members should give the phone back. So on this particular day that this incident happened, I think it happened earlier today, some Black Ass members decided to meet up with the Vikings members to return the phone. I think about two Black Ass members, they meet up with the Vikings members and they gave the phone back to the members of Vikings. This particular transaction happened in the territory of Vikings and the number one man of Vikings was said to also be in that particular place. And when they got there, the transaction was successful, they gave the phone back to the Vikings members and it is said that the number one man of Vikings and other Vikings members left. And why they were there, this young man and the person who put him in black ass and this young man, they were coming and they went to that particular location where the transaction took place. And it is said that the person that put this young man in black ass, when he got there, he got angry and he started saying, why will the black ass members give the phone back to the members of Vikings? So while he was angry, he brought out his tools. And when he brought out his tools, he was threatening the members of Vikings because he was really angry, saying that why should the black ass members give back the phone? So while he was vibrating, the Vikings members called their number one man that have left that particular location when they called him, they explained to him, telling him that this particular black ass member is angry and he is threatening them with a gun. 
and the Vikings number one man returned and immediately he was entering that particular place where they are he just started shooting I don't know if he was shooting up or what according to the information and when this happened the black ass member that was with the tool ran away and the other black ass members ran away and this young man that you are currently seeing on your screen was shot in the yash he couldn't run and he was already shot twice so what happened was that the Vikings members just walked up to him and they put a bullet in his head so as this young man was brought down the members of KK have been very happy about this situation and i am going to post some things that has been said by some members of kk and as you can see from this write-up this particular kk member is trying to explain that if you go against kk or if you leave kk for another confraternity as an embarrassment that this can also happen he just said that this should be a warning to other members of kk leaving a confraternity going to another confraternity that this can also be the faith of the person so this is what really transpired right there in abia state university and this whole situation is just somehow because right now information reaching me that black ass his squad are not looking for members of vikings and vikings are also looking for black ass members right there in abia state university so if you know any one that is in that university who is a member of black ass or members of vikings please tell them to hide your head anyway you are watching nigerian view